Welcome to episode number 37. My name is Nathan Ziegler, the Upper School Principal at Hope Academy. Today, I've got a magic trick with a coloring book. So I'm going to take these crayons and I'm going to hit them on the book. And if I take the book and hit them back on the crayons, everything disappears. This next trick is a trick that I have never performed before, so I hope it works. I took a pack of cards and cut it into two. Mrs. Ziegler, could you pick one from this side and one from this side, please? Thank you. Now, could you flip your cards over? And you can see that her cards match. Whew, I'm glad that worked. Mr. Johnson, one of our high school math teachers and a fellow dad, is going to bring you the math dad jokes today. Hey guys, it's Mr. Johnson here with a couple math questions for you to think about today. Uh, the first one is, let me see here. Why can you never trust a math teacher when they're holding graph paper? The answer is that they're always plotting something. <laughs> Here's the second one. What do you call a number that's always on the move? A Roman numeral. <laughs> Next one. What do you call two dudes who really love math? They would be algebras. <laughs> and then the fourth one is a question that's practical for living in Minnesota, and that's how do you stay warm in any room? Well, you should make sure you go to the corner because it's always 90 degrees there. <laughs> Thanks. Thank you, Mr. Johnson. You did not disappoint us with those jokes. Nice job. This Day in History with Mr. Randall. On May 12th, 907, the warlord Zhu Wen forced Chinese Emperor Ai into giving up his throne. This ended the Tang Dynasty after nearly 300 years of rule. 300 years is a long time. For context, the United States has only been a country for 244 years. <laughs> Neat. Yesterday's riddle was, what has a bed but never sleeps? The answer was a river. For today's riddle, what has two banks but no money? It's quarantine with Wiggle. Cute. Today's advice is from Senior Gabby Ruland. Hope seniors, they're all really nice. Hope seniors, gonna give you advice. Hope seniors, what they say should suffice. Hope seniors, seniors. Gabby wanted to share this with the rest of the students. Cherish every moment because high school passes by a whole lot quicker than you think. Sometimes in the moment you may feel like it's taking forever, but trust me, once you get to the end and look back, you will see how it flew by. Enjoy being a kid, a teenager, or whatever you want to call yourself because taking on adult responsibilities is hard and you won't want to be able to be a kid forever. Also, keep your friends close and keep God closer. He will never leave you and remember he has a plan for your life even when you don't understand it or when you don't see that plan. Thank you so much, Gabby. Have a wonderful day, everyone.